one of Africa's most fascinating and formidable snakes. Known for its striking appearance and potent venom, this large viper species has the longest fangs and one of the highest venom yields of any snake on the planet. Vitus gabonica was first described in 1854 under the name Echidna gabonica. It belongs to the genus Bytus, which includes several species of venomous vipers found across Africa. Commonly known as the gaboon viper, gaboon adder, butterfly adder and the forest puff adder. The gaboon viper has a close relative Bytus rhinoceros, or the Western Gaboon Viper. This separate species is similar but varies mainly in its range and size, with the rhinoceros being larger and up to two meters and also having the iconic horned nasal scales. Some of the footage used is of Bytus rhinoceros. The Gaboon Viper inhabits a wide range across Sub-Saharan Africa, including countries such as Guinea, Ghana, Nigeria, Cameroon, Gabon, and the Democratic Republic of Congo. Also can be found in smaller regions in Tanzania, Mozambique, and South Africa. This impressive snake is characterized by its large size and unique coloration, which mimics fallen leaves, providing excellent camouflage against the leaf litter of the forest floor. The Gaboon Viper displays a combination of light and dark browns arranged in a striking diamond shape along its back. Its large triangular head is accompanied by a surprisingly narrow neck. The Gaboon Viper is primarily terrestrial and thrives in humid environments such as rainforests and nearby woodlands. It generally prefers low altitude areas and can also be found in agricultural lands like cacao and coffee plantations. As one of the fastest striking snakes in the world, it can bury its huge fangs into unsuspecting prey in an instant. Their venom is an incredibly potent cytotoxic and cardiotoxic brew. This, coupled with its large venom glands and exceptionally long sheathed fangs, which can reach up to 5 centimeters, make this a very dangerous snake. Humans can expect rapid swelling, intense pain, blistering and possibly death if bitten. The diet of the Gaboon Viper mainly consists of small animals, rodents, rabbits, birds, amphibians and other reptiles. Less common prey include tree monkeys and even small antelope. Sometimes they do hunt actively but are well known for their ambush hunting style where they lie in wait for unsuspecting prey to come within striking distance. Unlike many vipers, they are known to hold onto their prey after striking. This helps ensure a huge dose of venom. Gaboon vipers are primarily nocturnal and exhibit a calm demeanor. They are known for their placid nature and rarely bite unless provoked. When disturbed, they may hiss or inflate their bodies as a warning, but prefer to remain motionless as a defense mechanism. They often employ rectilinear or caterpillar-like locomotion as they slowly and sluggishly make their way through their habitat. Adult Gaboon Vipers have few predators due to their size and camouflage. However, they can fall prey to larger snakes and birds of prey that are able to overcome their defenses. The Gaboon Viper is the largest viper species in Africa, reaching lengths of up to 1.8 meters. The largest individuals can have heads nearly 15 centimeters wide at their widest point. They are one of the heaviest venomous snakes in the world and can weigh over 10 kilograms. Like many snake species, males compete for the right to mate through combat where the victor is able to push the other snake's head to the ground whilst maintaining his head 
in a raised position. Gaboon vipers are viviparous, meaning they give live birth rather than laying eggs. Females give birth to litters that contain anywhere from 20 to 60 young snakes. In captivity, gaboon vipers can live up to 20 years or more with proper care. In the wild, their lifespan is much shorter due to environmental factors and predation risks. The species is abundant in its native habitat, which include tropical rainforests and moist woodlands across Central and West Africa. However, the destruction of these environments for agriculture and urban development poses significant threats to its population. The Gaboon Viper is currently listed as vulnerable on the International Union for Conservation of Nature Red List, primarily due to habitat loss and degradation resulting from deforestation and human encroachment. Thank you.